guys, welcome to my channel. So if you're new here, please consider subscribing. And today we are going to do the simplest DIY ever using a kulhar. Uh, I am sure that you might know what a kulhar is, but uh, there might be other names in different places. So we are going to DIY that today. Very, very, very easy. And it looks and turns out so beautiful. So yes, let's get right into the video. For this video, you are going to need some acrylic paints, some baking powder and kulhars. Now, these are kulhars. Uh, if you didn't know, I have also made a little hole at the bottom. You'll know that later on. So, first of all, I'm taking my favorite color paint and you just have to add it to the baking powder. You can, uh, you know, change the amount of baking powder you add according to yourself. Just make sure that the paint is runny and not very, like, you know, uh, thick. Then just go ahead and paint your uh, kulhars. Now, I did two coats because the first coat didn't make it look very ceramic type so by the way if i didn't tell you i am just trying to make my kulhars look a bit bit i am I'm going to try to make my kulhars uh, look a little bit uh, ceramic or, or terracotta or somewhere along those lines so that is why i'm adding this baking powder this uh, when the paint will dry it will make your kulhar look like ceramic and not like normal mitti wala kulhar so that is a very nice effect that you can add to almost any surface so i have taken two colors yellow and pink and yes this is after the two coats uh, it looks so much nicer in person as well so when that is done i'm just going to use these fevicryl 3d liners that were very kindly sent to me by Fevi uh, by fevicryl and i'm going to just uh, make some designs on that i'm using this pipe cleaner to you know uh, make a proper even length ke so half circles like uh, these semicircles that i'm making my upper niche nahi karna chahti thi that's why i'm using this pipe cleaner to measure it out because it's a circular surface it gets a little difficult Cult. so you can use any kind of a thread as well for this and you can make absolutely any design you can make these designs also which i am making but yeah basically any type of a zentangle or mandala design would look very very beautiful or you know you can diy it in your own way any way you like it so yes i'm just gonna now time lapse And yes, that is it. That brings us to the end of this first cooler. I kept the designs pretty simple and I love how this looks. For the first one, I used a green glitter 3D liner, which is actually, which has a very, uh, a little thicker nozzle, not very thick, but a little thicker. Now, there are different 3D liners that come in Fevicryl, which is this second one, which has, a, you know, comparatively a thinner nozzle and that helps you to make intricate designs. So, that is why I'm making a little bit of intricate design on this pink color. Uh, so, you can, uh, you know, make in your own way, whichever way you like to. You can also make designs using a paint brush but I feel it gets too tiring and it's a very tedious process to make with a paintbrush uh, so I think these 3d liners work the best and they are pretty cheap too so yeah I think that is the best uh, way to make these types of uh, little drawings now you can do this uh, whole DIY on glass jars as well that looks amazing and yes we are done <laughs> So I'm going there and we are going to make that. So let's go. So you can keep these kulhars as it is for decoration or any flower vases or something. But we decided to make them into lamps. So that is why we have hung this wire through the hole that we made. Remember and we actually made one more hole to uh, give it a 
better uh, strength then we're just taking some led lights to stick it inside now you can actually put in bulbs which will be much better but since it's locked down we were working with whatever we have at home so this is how it looks after the leds are in and just look how pretty these look i just love 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 this so much mm -hmm. so, i hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, it was a very very simple diy which anyone can do and yeah uh, probably the easiest one on my channel and yes i just wanted to tell you that i have been doing a hell lot of transition type videos on my instagram and on my mod so if you have not been following me there please go ahead and do that give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and also subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video till then bye